everybody, and welcome to The Roulette. I am your host, Michael Riley. With me is Dane Forgione. Oh, okay. Uh, Billy Carter. Hey! Jason Amherst. What up? And we're playing some N64 games, so let's get right the F to it. Spinning it. Let's begin in it. Oh, I discovered. By the way, uh, still two. But by, by the way, I want to point out, uh, still have two vetoes. Just in case you wanted to use one, I don't know. Yeah, you may or may not want to use one on this one. I don't know. Mm. All Star Baseball. All Star Baseball. Uh, Acclaim sports. Uh, yeah. Uh, a bargain bin game after a year. <laughs> That's up to you guys if you want to veto it. You want to veto this, dude? Yeah, you know what? We got two. Why not? Yeah, well, I don't want to see baseball. I'm going to have to see it enough this summer. Uh, it's got to be unanimous. Dane, you want to veto this? Oh, yeah, sure. Let's do it. All right, let's do it. Uh, hey, look, hey, 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 hey. What? I never, I didn't, that sounded suspiciously like you. Oh, well, do you want to veto this, Dane? Remember, it's got to be unanimous. No. Oh, all right, well. You don't want to, you don't want to veto uh, a claim sports fine, baseball? Fine, 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 fine. Vito and bunch of bunch of babies. No, I'm just kidding. Anyway, welcome to the performers I know. This is episode number Schmedrick. Schmedrick. Um, Schmedrick. Schmedrick. That's after uh, that's the episode yeah, that comes Schmedrick. after that's the episode that comes after Schmooly. Yeah, that's right. My, speaking of Schmooly, my my guest today is the great Schmooly. Hello. That's all. Yes. Oh, there's two of you. Oh, that's great. Shmooly brought his brother, Ghoulie. Hey, we're yeah. playing. Were you, were you grabbed this by the ghoulies? Were you grabbed by the I was, ghoulies? I was grabbed by the gobble ghoulies. <laughs> by the gobble ghoulies. Yes. Oh, man, oh, man. Oh, look at the little dude. Should I be oh, Dave, Fred. Davey, Fred. Jack, Fred, oh. or Linda? Fred is a Fred's my mood right now. Fred, there. <laughs> it's beautiful weather. I'm just an ordinary chameleon until that's actually not even. A, that's just an iguana. That's not a chameleon. Here comes a rabbit. This is totally not Wait, Alice in uh, Wonderland. I was gonna say this is this seems oddly specific to Alice in Wonderland. <laughs> oh dear! Oh dear! I'm running late. <laughs> What's up, man? How's it going? Hey man, you want to oh, smoke some weed? In such a hurry! Oh my God, look at that pot! That's what I'm saying. You want to smoke some of that with me? Has this pot? That's a big pot. Has this been here the whole time? <laughs> Just noticed this. How did I not notice that? Huh? Hmm. Well, Yolo. <laughs> I'm just a bill here on Capitol Hill. Wait, what? Oh my god, I changed! I'm a Power Ranger! Whoa! <laughs> I'm, I'm a Bomberman! And I'm sleepy. <laughs> Where's my mouth? This is Jungle Land, the gateway to the mysterious world. Go to the training room if you need to practice tongue and body control. In there, you'll nah, find. I got a, that down pat. In, in, there uh, you, in there, you'll find a woman. No. Hmm. No, I already know Whoa. how to play the game. Yeah. Crown. You got a crown. Whoa, that's trippy. That skybox. Swing your balls from side. This is like... Hey, y'all. Like if Yoshi you know, was a freaking Power Ranger. You know, apparently yeah, John Cena... 
apparently John Cena was naked at the Oscars, but I didn't see him. <laughs> Neither did I. Yeah, he but, was. Uh, apparently it was a uh, a uh, protest thing. Uh, had to do with the... Uh, the Costume Designers uh, Union? Costume Union? Designers Guild. Yeah. Yeah. You're naked without us, essentially. Yep. So, good guy Cena. Standing up for the small guys. Speaking of... <laughs> while, like, while almost showing his small guy. Speaking of wacky moments at the Oscars, I'm sure you guys saw Al Pacino just giving zero oh, yeah. fuck. <laughs> I thought... According, according to him... He kind of like... Kind of had deja vu. <laughs> according to him, he was told to do that due to time constraints. And also the fact that well, we've already shown clips from every movie. Why do we need to announce them again? What, uh, what happened? Okay, so he come, he came out, and was just like, okay, here's the uh, best uh, best picture, and it, it, it's Oppenheimer. Okay, bye. That was it. Yep. Show over. <laughs> like he didn't go over the nominees again. He just read that it's Oppenheimer. He didn't go over the non anomalies arise. That's right. I'm, I'm I'm just happy that Godzilla won an Academy Award. I think we all are, Bill. Yeah. All the years that film snobs have been been saying that Godzilla is low tier entertainment. They could they could eat it now. Eat it. Eat it. Uh, meanwhile, I have lost all respect for Austin St. John. And why is that? Never had any uh, respect he was for on, him. Uh, he, he was on the Tuned Up podcast with uh, Jim Cummings, and he was talking about uh, making a merchandise line with quotes from various warriors of history including the good and the bad of warriors across history, which included Hitler, who had some pretty good one-liners. Ah, shit. Uh, no one would buy that. And he wasn't a warrior. He was actually a, a wuss. He just knew how to manipulate people. It's true. That's it. You know, like... I, I, I saw the clip and I'm just like, I just cringed so hard. I'm like, well, I guess uh, I guess there's only one Red Power Ranger now from from Mighty Morphin, Steve Cardenas. Yeah, I, I'm actually friends with Steve on Facebook. Same, same. The uh, Austin, well, <laughs> Mister Bloated. Fuck yourself. Dude. Now, if he would have, now, if he would have said Hitler, at all, if he would have said like Genghis Khan, I'd have been like, oh, okay, I could get down with that, because Gen Genghis Khan was actually a badass. <sighs> um, which, which one of the Power Rangers killed somebody in real life? None of them. Wait a uh, minute. Wait a minute. Hold on. Uh, it was uh, Wild Force Red. Yeah, that's right. Wild Force Red. Yeah, it killed his roommate. Yep, with a sword. Hmm. Uh, that's not what I was supposed to be doing with that. Hold on. That ain't what I'm supposed to be doing. Boy, I tell it, you. It, it wasn't. A, it was just after he got done doing a season of Power Rangers again. Because he was in another season. Yeah, he played uh, he played the villain in uh, Samurai. Yeah, a villain in Samurai. Yeah. Well, he turned out to be a real life villain. How the heck do I swing you know, around the pole? Right, That's what I'm trying right. to figure it, out. Actually, when when his roommate died, they, they it, it took them a while to figure out that he was the one that did it. Hmm. It was, uh, I think it was like a few years before they really discovered that he was the one that killed him. 
<clears throat> hey, hey, Lois. Billy Jack Hayes killed his wife. That's true, he did, didn't he? <laughs> That's right, Peter. <laughs> Billy Jack Hayes did kill his wife. Uh, BRB. I forgot. I, uh, yeah, I forgot about that. I was I was listening to. Um, well, this Cornette's happened like a couple of weeks ago. Yeah, I know. I was listening to Cornette's uh, podcast and he was talking about it. That's him. Big Billy Jack Hayes. He killed his wife. Then, 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 fuck you, bye. <laughs> You're turning Jim Cornette into Boomhauer, Dane. <laughs> well, you get Cornette going, and he sounds like a high-pitched Boomhauer. Just give him a damn Sprite. That's all he wants. <laughs> you die I at damn my mom, my goddamn Sprite, you fucking big, fat, 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 pig, and <laughs> yeah. pop on them young bucks. <laughs> young bucks. <laughs> Just randomly at the end. Young bucks. I said yeah. young cut. <laughs> <laughs> Matthew Man, and he just Jack goes. And, uh, blah, blah, blah. <laughs> he just goes after AEW so hard. Hey, man, man, let me tell you something. It's JR, so... that young cut licked my balls. And you fell down. I, I, it's, it, it's like from the very beginning, he hated AEW just because of who was their founding everything in it. I mean, wasn't it also the fact that. <clears throat> He got mad because he wanted, he offered to book for them, and they were like, no. Ah. Well, he never liked the Young Bucks to begin with. Even when they were in TNA, he didn't like them. Can't imagine why. I don't know. Well, I, I mean, mean, I'm, I'm, not... being, Fuck. I'm being sarcastic. Oh, Okay. I mean, I'm not a fan of them, but I, I heard that they are kind of uh, buttholes. Mm-hmm. Dad. Dad. That's right. <laughs> Fuck. Fuck. Excuse me, one minute. Okay, everybody. Just I leave. used to be the... All right, everybody, just leave. That's fine. I, I'm fine. <laughs> I'm right here. I used to be the sparring partner of Muhammad Ali. Ali, that's right. <laughs> oh, God. It's Golem Gorillas. Golillas. Actually, this game's not half bad, is it? Hope it's all bad. Oh, oh. Yay. Looks like what looks like one of those hidden gems that was out there. It's fine. It's just frustrating to control sometimes. I wish I remembered how to fucking swing around the the post. That's my only issue. That's my only issue. But I don't remember how to do it, so Oh, that's how you do it. I just remembered. God damn it, I want to spunk. I'm going to shit out of my <laughs> Spunk off your chin. What? Wait, what? <laughs> what that last part, Jim? Nothing. I didn't say nothing about no jizz on the chin. What the hell are you talking about? What are you talking about up there? there I'm going to you stupid... Give me, I'm on, I'm on my, my, my terror queen right now. God damn it. I'll tell about, you what I'll tell you. About God damn it. My terror queen. I mean Missy Hyatt. God damn it. All I said I want a goddamn Pepsi and a Sprite and a juice in that lemon. Do you remember that? <laughs> Thank you. Fucking Jesus. <laughs> What? What's so goddamn funny? <laughs> Wee! I died. Fuck it. Wee! I died. I tell you what, Missy Hyatt back in the day, back in the early nineties. <laughs> yeah, but WCW. back before all her plastic surgery. 
Yeah. Yes. That, that's what. I, that's why I said back in the day. Yeah. Now she just <laughs> looks w- like a walking <laughs> skeleton. <laughs> yeah, that's true. <laughs> and there's also that whole she killed the guy. There's also that whole. Yeah. You, you're epic. <laughs> um, but yeah, back in the day in WCW, uh, like 92, 91. Oh yeah, I would have tapped that. Of course, uh-huh. everybody else did. But... Yeah, you would have had you would have had uh, gotten stuff for her blades if you'd have done that. But I was yeah. gonna say she literally she literally blew Jake Roberts at one point. So you know. yeah, yeah. Uh, she could so be did... a show on VH1 called "I Fucked the '90s." That's true. Hulk. She was dating Hawk from the Legion of Doom. Uh huh. Mm-hmm. Yep, and that's uh... why he decided to jump off of the Titan Tron. Who else did she date? Uh, Eddie Gilbert. Oh my God! It's Congo Musha. Huh? It is Congo oh. Musha. Congo, what are you doing here? <laughs> hey, you know, you just, 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 just hanging out. Man. Oh, is this one? Was he had to knock the knock yeah, him off? I gotta the, knock him off the, the ledge. So it's like just beating the big bully. Yeah, I'm sorry to do this to you, Congo. Farewell. Had to, had to be done. <laughs> no. It's too bad Jace oh. had the BRB for a second. <laughs> <laughs> the rock fell on his head. Yep, Dwayne Johnson <laughs> fell on his head. And Freddie's oh, like, dear. Wh- whatever. <laughs> oh, whatever. I don't give a fuck. I did it. I don't care. Thoughts on uh, Chameleon Twist Dane? Um, I know a lot of people like this game, but I wasn't really enthralled with it. It's not terrible, but it was just kind of kind of meh, to my opinion. All right, uh, Billy. If I find it for a cheap price, I'll buy it. I mean, I, I don't want to spend no more than maybe twenty dollars for it. But, uh, yeah, this looks like it was a good little budget title at the time. Yeah, it's uh, it's fine. I mean, it's not like it's terrible or anything. The idea is good. Uh, controls are a little frustrating sometimes. Um, but outside of that, like, it's fine. There's nothing really wrong with it. It's a standard platformer. Scores out of 10, Dane. Five. Billy. I'll give it a six. I will also give it a six. It's, it's almost evil. It's a good thing I didn't say what I originally wanted to say, because then that would have been evil. <laughs> you, wait, what were you originally going to say? He was going to say a six. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, like, hey, it's, al- it's almost there. But like I said, it is <laughs> sad that Jace basically missed that. <laughs> Spin a wheel, see what we're playing. Second game of the episode. Okay. Deadly farts. Well, uh, that's it's misspelled on the wheel there, but you, you get the idea. <laughs> Atlas. I'll tell you what it was Would spelled. Miss- it says... <laughs> Wrecked him. Yeah, that's it. Nice. Wrecked him. Damn near killed him. Yeah. Uh, yeah. So you I miss- missed... You- Oh, snowboard king. Yeah, I misspelled it on the wheel. Yeah. Snowboard, snowboard kind. Awesome. You snowboard missed uh, you missed chameleon, please. I I put an N in kids. Well, I mean I, I caught most of it, but uh I I had uh, briefly relieve uh eight. Uh, snowboard kinds had, is how I wrote it on the wheel. The snowboard kinds. Which is probably the, this is probably the best snowboarding game. It is pretty good. I wouldn't go as far to say it's the best snowboarding game. Yeah, yeah, 1080. Yeah, 1080, yeah. which is on the wheel. Uh, which is is the best one, I would have to say. Yeah. Uh, so I think I have to go with uh, Chesty LaRue. Linda? Linda? Chesty? Yeah. Are yeah. these like old kids? Yeah, but she has like huge hooters. <laughs> That really makes no that, sense. 
No, it really doesn't. It doesn't. No, seriously. They, if you've seen like the character art for the first game, they, she's like hypersexualized, which I don't understand that. I'm not so sure about that one, uh, Atlas. Uh, yeah, I was gonna say I don't know. I don't know what you do with Atlas, but you. To be fair, you're, though, you're, 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 I I have been called a kid well into my thirties, so you know. Yeah, I got mm. called that the other day, and I looked over at the guy, and I said, I am almost 40 years old. I am far from a kid and what behind the ears. And then they said, well, this is a Denny. And then they said, well, you're a kid to me. And I said, well, fuck you. Pay my bills then. <laughs> oh, yeah. 40-year-old is a kid to you. Yeah. And you're yeah. in diapers. If 40 years old is a kid to you, you need to go to a nursing home. <laughs> Yeah, exactly. See, look at her outfit. No! Yeah. She's got Whoa. fucking pointy-ass little Madonna boobies. I don't care. That, oh, my God. I don't care. I I'm don't care. Hey, Dave, look at the pointy boobies on this clearly child. No. Look, Dane. <laughs> As I just said, snowboard kid. As I just said, I've been called a kid well into my thirties. These could be legal adults. <laughs> it doesn't with gigantic noses. Kid is a state of mind. Exactly. Uh, it's also an no. age too, so you got to watch out for that. But but it's seriously, like these kids with these huge honkers. You know, <laughs> you think any of them related to Ziggy? Because they the, get those big with noses. The, with, the, with the big honkadongalos. With the big honagonga bagadalongos. <laughs> <laughs> Will you? What? I mean, they all got up, you fucking dunkle dark. <laughs> God damn. With the big old hobba dumba levels. <laughs> Bonga longa hunga logongus. <laughs> Michael. <laughs> Listen, Flapperoo, all I'm saying Flapperoo. is it's a strange choice for yeah. for a, a character in a game called Snowboard Kids to be that hyperly sexualized. Yes, it is. It's very strange. That's all I'm saying. I ain't, I'm not interested in fucking this character. That is not my point. Okay, I'm very glad that you said that because I was starting because to get... that knows. I would oh, never be interested in fucking this character. What? It's ugly. It's homemade. Now crap. Jessica Rabbit on you. She's well. You no, know, she's at least you for sure an adult. <laughs> I, I mean, yeah. I. Yeah. Mike would give her the tongue band of a life. I'm not her type. She's in. She's into rabbits. <laughs> she's in the furries. <laughs> yeah, basically. He makes me, he makes me laugh. He makes me uh, laugh. I mean, what? I can make you laugh, too. What? Take your clothes off to, and I'll tickle you. To be fair, Jessica Rabbit is also a rabbit. That's true, she is. Well, rabbit by my match. Also, rabbit by... Uh, you see her ears literally in the first movie. In the movie. <laughs> I remember that. So she she moves her hair. Yeah, yeah. Her, her hair stands up like she has an ear under it. Oh. Uh, kind of like how in the Stimson's arcade game, when Marge gets electrocuted, you see rabbit ears. Remember that? Yeah, yeah. because she was meant to be one of the rabbit people from uh, Life and Hell. Yes. Mike, what are you doing? I'm trying to get in the Mike, fucking you... lift. Yeah. I lost all my like, momentum. Yeah, I know. It's because I lost all my momentum when I hit the bottom of the hill. Not momentum. Um, that's what happens when you have huge gonga longa fogalo bongas. <laughs> all right, you know what? You know what? Um, you, you can do the fogalos. Now, you would think being forward heavy would really help out going downhill. <laughs> it's true. <laughs> I mean, no, you 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 just fall down the hill and wind up becoming a giant snowball. Yeah. But nonetheless. Cool potato. Ooh, puff potato. Oh, doggy style. Ooh, puff potato. 
smack like right into it. Doggy style a bag of potato yeah. chips? I, depending on the chips, if they're really good. If they're kettle cooked, oh god, yeah. If they're kettle cooked, I'll fuck them. I'll fuck <laughs> a whole bag of Lay's. Why do you think they're called just Lay's? Make sure it, just make sure they're not salt and vinegar. I'm, that I'm would with, burn. I'm that with pain on this one. Yes, yeah, burn salt and vinegar would burn my pee pee. <laughs> Dane, <laughs> Dane, shut the fuck up. You've said much worse. <laughs> you literally, you literally in Jim Cornette voice said Jews did 9/11 less than 10 minutes ago. <laughs> what? What? They said no thing. The fuck you didn't. Play it back. God damn it, Lord, I said, I want a goddamn Pepsi and a Sprite and a Jews did 9-11 and did 9 11 and did 9 11 and did 9 11 and That was clearly, that was clearly Jim Cornette himself. That wasn't me. Come on. Uh-huh. What are you? Okay, fine. It was my twin brother, Zane. Oh, Zane B- did that? Oh, B- that's Billy, Billy Zane? Damn. Ah! That's right. Billy Zane is my twin brother. Billy Zane for Joe. That's right. <laughs> he was the asshole in uh, Titanic. <laughs> yeah, as opposed to you, who are the asshole on uh, Retro Roulette. <laughs> That's right. That's right. And, and don't and, you forget it. I never, I never freaking, have. Don't you forget about it. And, Ready? and Billy Zane is freaking hilarious in, in Demon Knight, that movie. Yes, I'm sure all three people who saw that movie. Uh-huh. Ho duck, ho duck, mother. No, no kid. Snubbo kid. Mother. What are you playing? I'm playing snowbo kid. I'm playing snowboard kinds. Yeah. I'm playing snowbo kid. Oh, what? What the heck is that? Snowbo. Invisible. Kid. I'm John Cena. Oh, never mind. Invisible. Invisible, invisible. I'm Ricky Stanicki. How you doing, everybody? Ricky Stanicki. We need to have a crossover between Ricky Stanicki and Ricky Smith. Or, or, or not. But they need to. They need to have a crossover. John Cena, Adam Sandler, Little Stanicki. Mm-hmm. Oh Lord, no! Get it, Ricky, get in the flask. Yeah. Pop my oh, sugar is fucking oh, awesome. Can't see. The me. reason I talk like this is because John Cena hit me in the side of the face with a shovel. Damn. <laughs> he said it was. He said I was gonna get buried. Yes, <laughs> kids. Bing bong. Bing bong. Yes, that is a character in, in, in Inside Out. All right. <laughs> he died. Dear Sega, <laughs> bring back snowboard kids, you cowards. <clears throat> what, did Se- Dear- what did Sega have to do with this? Or do they own Atlas? They own Atlas. Okay, I see. Dear Sega CD, bring back Night Trap, you cowards. Dear Sega CD, why can you be a standalone console instead of leeching off of the Genesis? That's true. Oh, yeah, that's right. Oh, uh... Night Trap did get re-released. Oh, uh, there was the yeah, uh, Sega CDX or something like that, which was like an all-in-one device. Yeah, it was. Yeah, it was a Genesis and that all-in-one. Yeah. Yeah. Kind of looked like a portable CD player with a Genesis like port. I have a friend that has that. And- He's had the laser fixed so many times. What the fuck? Did that uh, mouse? You just, just got a bunch of money. Yeah. Did the mouse just shake his ass at me? 
Yes. The mouse shook his ass and made it rain. So, what the fuck kind of a game is this? You got mice, you got mice shaking their asses. Giant kid tits. <laughs> yeah, this game, this game is madness. Right. I mean, this chick is this chick is obviously the chick that developed way too early in elementary school. That's true. Uh, we uh, all knew. We all knew a woman. We all knew a girl like that. That 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 happened to. Yeah. She's clearly the. Uh, and immediately all the, the boys for the, uh, went down. I dated. She's the prototype for the gal in uh, <laughs> Hokkaido Gals. Billy knows what I'm talking about. Yes. I don't know what 26 of those words meant. Most weeks. Well, because, I mean, she's a scantily clad uh, female in uh, leopard print. Uh huh. Oh, okay. So, for anime. Hokkaido is a very silly place in Japan. It is a very silly place. Get coin! If you want to go see good uh, comedy, that's where you go. <coughs> that or Osaka. Osaka's another cool place to go. I was I was told this. They said, if you want to have a spectacle and a fun time, go to Tokyo. <laughs> but if you just want to have a good time, go to Osaka. Damn. Uh, let's see and it's here. the only it's the only place where you could walk up to a random person, point your finger at them, you know, like a gun, and go bang bang or pew pew, and they'll go oh. It's the only place you could go. That... Uh, uh, meet a Don John Dale Jr. Wink the eye, point a finger. Meet a Don Dale Jr. Wink the eye, point a finger. Why? That no. was cool, I guess. Just, just because people at Osaka got really good. Sense Listen, of Dane. Uh, former cop undercover just got shot now recovered. Former cop undercover just got shot now recovered. Why? Penis. Um, spaghetti. Finding crime with a partner, Lois Lane, Jimmy Carter. Finding crime with a partner, Lois Lane, Jimmy Carter. Woo, 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 woo. What the fuck are you doing? What the fuck are you doing? It's a song. <laughs> What's wrong? I-A-I-A-I-O by System of a Down. <laughs> oh. oh, yeah, okay. I-A-I-A-I-O. <laughs> so you know that song know by... Oh my bones. So you know that new album by Imagine Dragon? Uh, what what album is that? Imagine Dragon, these nuts across your face. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> But I, yeah, I was. I gotta I be was, honest with you, folks. I actually thought Mike was gonna put that back on me, but no, he did not. D Dean is very quickly devolving into uh, an American VTuber. <laughs> that is true. The fact that oh, you're saying the, the fact that you're saying that's a de-evolution. <laughs> oh, it's a de-evolution. Oh, it oh, is. My eyeballs. Uh, Blinking correctly. Uh, I will be right back, guys. <laughs> uh, I gotta go. I gotta go. Uh, you, usually, uh. usually Ashley is the one making the cringe, like pseudo VTuberisms, where you're just kind of going, "Wow, that was so non sequitur." I'd swear this was a. Uh, TikTok clip of a VTuber. Well, you see, since Ashley's not here, I have to pick up the slap. <laughs> so, like, I love you, homies. <laughs> love you, Dottie. dear name. Dottie. I love Dottie, you. Dottie, no. I love, I love you too, homos. Homies, sorry. Dottie, you cannot <laughs> lick my vagina. Excuse okay? me. Okay, I love you. I don't, think, you I, I, don't think, I don't think she's ever said that. In the history of ever, <laughs> has she never asked Dottie to not lick her vagina? Because that's not something well, a never... dog would do. I mean, how would how would that do? Yeah. I mean, you've not, you've had to do with Ashley twenty four seven. You don't know what she does behind closed doors. Ow! Oh, that guy's got it. 
He made me lose all my momentum. Me mo mo ma me momentum. My momentum, my momo. Alright, I have to pick up the slack with for Ashley. Look, okay. You guys could just suck my lady balls. This ain't no Daytona. That's right. I just wanna say I wanna say, Mike, that I'm I'm really proud of you. Cause you're 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 in fourth place right now in snowboard kids. And I'm I'm rooting for you, home. Was that, was that good? Shoot him! Shoot him! Shoot him! Yeah! Take that, you jerk! Take that, you scumbag! Take that, you boss Watch out for that tree! Vito! Whoa! Oh no! You shouldn't have done that! I pizzaed when I should have french fried. You french fried when you, you should have pizza. Uh oh. Oh, you're an Eh. Eh. Oh no! He froze you! He froze to me! That son's a bitch! That's the bitch of son! Bitch of son, won't you come? <laughs> bitch tit son, won't you come? Say bitch tits, son? He just knows wiener tits. Wiener tits? That's crazy. <laughs> you know what's really crazy? Franklin comes alive. Do, yeah. do you feel? Oh, come on. Do you feel? Oh, he's touring. Touring. Nice. He's the shroud. Of he's the shroud of Turin. He's the shroud of Turin. Can you feel? Can oh, you feel? come on. <laughs> he shot him. Just... Yeah. He finished anyway, and I just said, fuck it. Why did I shoot the fat kid? I don't know. Yeah. That's crazy. He had it coming to him. What are you going to call him? I get that. Because he's fat? Oh, she, looks like, she looks like a plague doctor. <laughs> <laughs> she does. With that nose. Yeah. She's wearing the mask, but she's not wearing much else. Look at this. How's that going to protect oh. you from the plague? Oh my god. You're going to get a plague in your boobies. Uh, thoughts on I snowboard tits? She, looks like, uh, she looks like a spy versus spy character. Thoughts on snowboard tits? Uh, snowboard kids, Dane. Um, <laughs> like I said, I prefer 1080 snowboarding. But this game is pretty good. Um... It looks like it's a lot of fun, and uh, I would play it myself if I had it. Yep. Uh, Jason? You know, when you don't have Mario Kart, this is a great substitute. Like, this right here is a freaking fun-ass time. Do, 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 do. Uh, I mean, like, these, these courses are pretty damn good. You know, they are well-paced. The weapons are pretty fun. You know the the characters are uh, are, are funny, you know, and, and the music is really freaking bumping. You know, it's it's an all around good game. Billy, I have fond memories playing this at birthday parties and other events. Fond memories. Yes. Misty watercolored memories. Memories, yes, memories. Uh, yeah. Uh, it's it's quite fun. It, uh, again, 1080 snowboarding is probably just overall a better snowboarding game. But if you're looking for something easy to pick up, uh, easy to get into, hours of fun. I mean, you can't go wrong with snowboard kids. S scores out of 10, Dane. Seven. Jason. Nine. 
Billy. Eight. I'm also going to give it an eight. Also, uh, Chameleon Twist, eight. <laughs> Just to uh, insert that in there. Okay, last game of the oh episode. Oh, boy! It's... All right, it's Hockey Night in America, guys. Okay. All righty. Yep, that's what I want. Well, at least uh, there are uh, alternatives because uh, Mupen is open source. So there are other Mupen based emulators out there. <laughs> Nobody knows what the hell Jace is talking about because we just started recording again. <laughs> Totally not having issues with our emulation. I don't know why you would even say that. Oh man, there's there's apparently I mean, some uh, the, apparently some what? There's some shenanigans going on with X Men ninety seven. Yeah, that the uh, head writer got fired like literally yeah. a week ago, like before the show comes out. Yeah, what's up with that? What yeah, do I do? don't know. That crazy bastard. Okay. <laughs> Good start. What? Why? What? 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 Oh God! Fuck! You guys can't see it. Yeah. God damn it! Why didn't you tell me? I don't know. Oh, hey. Mike, you fat, 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 fat. I already scored fat. once. Yeah. Fat, 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 fat. Oh. But yeah, you guys gotta, you guys gotta be heads up with me if I'm not capture, if I'm, if you're not seeing the game, because I could go ten minutes and you never see anything, and I never know. <laughs> that defeats fat, the purpose. Fat, fat. That would defeat the purpose of the show. <laughs> fat, fat, fat. <laughs> I still don't understand why they're calling them the Long Island Islanders. It's not. It's the New York Islanders, big way. Come on. Are they not like based in Long Island? They are, but they're not called the Long Island Islanders. They're not calling them Long Island Islanders. They're just saying in Long Island because that's where they're from. But 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 that's not the. I'm sorry, that wasn't even English. Wee! He's this. I don't even have to insult you. You're, you're scoring goals already. It's true. Wow. Forbes released the uh, list of richest Americans. And, uh... The winner, Jim Davis, is listed at number 215. The Garfield guy? I'm assuming that's what they mean. $5.1 billion. Not bad for a guy who doesn't even apparently draw the fucking comic anymore. Uh, Robert Kraft is number 62 at uh, $11.1 billion. We're 62. We're 62. Where's Donald Trump? He's in my ass. Let's see. Ew, Elon Muskrat is number one? Uh, yeah. Yeah. Elongated muskrat. All that money he lost, and he's still worth two hundred fifty billion dollars. That holy crap! Holy crap! What the hell? What? Anime Boston keeps announcing freaking guests. Wow! Okay. Totally unexpected that they would announce guests. I'm shocked. 
somebody, uh, called, somebody, what he somebody, needs somebody, is, somebody called the Philippines. Like, like right before the convention, like a few weeks before the convention. They, they the, announced uh, lotus okay. juice. Lotus juice? Uh, they were a rapper that sounds, has sounds, done music for the Persona games. Sounds delicious. Uh -huh. uh, along with music for uh, Shin Kamen Rider. Also, Raj Ramaya, who did music for Cowboy Bebop and Ghost in the Shell. Hmm. And Resident Evil, apparently. Uh -huh. Yeah. No, they're still announcing guests out of nowhere. It's like, holy crap, what the hell? Uh, like, they're they're going to have freaking Lady Baby. Or, or rather, what? they're not Lady Baby anymore. They are now Baby Beard. Baby Beard. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you know, uh, you, what about, you know, uh, what about Lady, lady Beard? What about Lady Beard? <laughs> well, that's the thing. The guy's name is Lady Beard. He's an Australian pro wrestler in Japan. Ah, oh, that's interesting. He also sings death metal vocals with kawaii cute girls in an idol group. Similar to basically what if Death Clock fused with baby metal. That's an interesting combination. Yeah. This is their first concert ever in the United States, and it's going to be at Anime Boston. I'm like, wow, holy crap. Like, God damn they it. just keep on announcing guests left and right. I'm like, I'm glad I got my badge last year when it was only 90 bucks. I can see why they're charging more and more for their ticket, because it's like, with this many guests? Holy shit. Special guest, Ernest Borgnine. Woo! 20 seconds left. <laughs> Fuck. Oh no. Fat, fat, buddy, fat, 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 fat. Fat. Mike, you fat, fat, fat piece of shit. Hey! I'm supposed to be. He tripped me. I'm supposed to be auditioning somebody at 8 o'clock. And now. Poopy, poopy, poopy. Poopy, 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 poopy. Oh Get my god. Absolutely fucked. I guess my I guess my anger fueled you to win. Yay! Good, good job. The Islanders win again. Woo! If only Mike was the coach of the Islanders. Duh. Thoughts on Wayne Gretzky's 3D Hockey 98 day? Well, the Islanders won, so I'm happy. This is a. Because of that, this is a great game. If they had lost, this would be a terrible game. All right. Jason. <laughs> you know, I mean, I think this was the last one they made. Uh, and, you know, until they came back with uh, with it as NHL hits. Um, and, uh, yeah, I mean, again, solid game. So. Billy. Hi, I'm brilliant. I used to be fat. All right. Uh, yep. Uh, although I will say it's just I like it because I'm, I was a big fan hey. of Wayne Gretzky. But if you had a no, you don't. No, you don't get to talk now. You interrupted me. <laughs> shut up. No, you shut up. You had your chance. <laughs> shut up. No, you shut up. Wait to put your dick in your dick. Uh, no. <laughs> Anyway, uh, it's just it's Wayne Gretzky's 3D Hockey. If you played one, you've played them all. It's the same yep. thing as 3D Hockey 98, uh, 97. It's the same thing as it's actually the same thing as Olympic Hockey 98 as well. So if you played both of those, you've played this one. It's the same game. Midway literally changed almost nothing. Score scores out of ten, Dane. Nine. Ow! Jason. Oh, excuse me. Eight. Billy. I'm going to slap you in Nine. the face with my butt if you do not. Uh, uh, I'll give it an eight. On this episode, we played Chameleon Twist, Snowboard Kids, and Wayne Gretzky's 3D Hockey, 98. Uh, best game of the episode, Dane. Wayne Gretzky's 3D Hockey, 98. Jason. 
Oh, this is friggin' tough. This is three really good games, actually. Like, I... I, I like all three of these. Because <laughs> Chameleon Twist is a fun platformer, and Silver Kids is a fun, like, Mario Kart-ish racing game. Hi. Uh, I'm gonna go with, uh... Sorry, Chameleon Twist. Uh, Snowboard Kids edges you out All just right. by a hair. Billy. Did he leave again? Fine, I'm going to pick for I, him. I I pick uh, my anus. Uh, I'm going to pick Greg. Hey, what a good game. Yeah, what a good game. My anus 64. <laughs> it's my favorite. <laughs> Uh, uh, if I my nose. <laughs> thanks for joining us for Retro Roulette. If you like what we do, please hit subscribe. Be sure to hit the bell to be notified of upcoming videos. For Dane Fortune, Jason Amherst, and Billy Carter, I'm Mike Riley saying see you next time on Retro Roulette.